Oh, oh, hold up. <gasps> oh my god! Yo! I just hit a clat in the six on! I just hit a clat in her six on! That dude's being super annoying. Oh, oh, oh. Hello. Come on. Ooh. Ooh, keep them coming. Ah, uh, hold on. I might have another opportunity. Hold on. Ah, <laughs> it was going to be too split. Ooh, ooh. Oh, he's dead. Oh, there's another one. There's another one. <sighs> I got scared. I got scared. Finally got my CUAV. I'm sorry, that's the AUAV, my bad. Advanced UAV. Oh, come on. Oh, that got split. Yo, I'm on a 15 streak right now. Yo. Okay. Can we get another 15, though? Can we drop a nuke? Bro, a shipment nuke? Imagine. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, that's 20. <gasps> Oh, that was nice. Nice little quad feed. I'm gonna clip that right there. Oh, keep them coming. Oh, I'm getting so scared. Dude, my heart is pounding. Holy crap. Holy crap. My arms are shaking. Oh, I'm getting nervous. Oh, oh, there's 25. Oh, we can do this. Oh, it's 26. Oh, 27. Holy crap. Oh, oh, oh my, there's 28, no way, no, oh, come on, come on, come on, oh my god, where is it, where is it, come on, oh, I missed, I missed, hold up, we got it, no way, holy crap, yo, I'm launching it right now, screw it, I'm not waiting, I'm not waiting, let's end it, holy crap, oh, I just dropped a shipment nuke, holy crap, <laughs> yo, yo. Oh my god. No way. No way. Wow, dude. Ah, oh, 90 and 21. Holy crap, dude. What's up, guys? Keith here, aka Dean Tricks. Thank you so much for tuning in. I greatly appreciate it. Hopefully, you guys had a fantastic holiday season. I know I did. Even though it was really tiring, it was very busy, so I didn't get to upload again before Christmas or before New Year's. But wishing you guys a happy 2023 nonetheless. But as you can see on the screen, guys, and also by the title and the thumbnail, I unlocked the Orion camo. In my last video, I was stating that I was going for the polyatomic camo. Right after that video, I unlocked polyatomic. And on Friday, I said, screw it. I want to go ahead and unlock the Orion camo because it is beautiful. I grinded out all the guns on shipment that day. And later on that night, I dropped a nuke right after unlocking the Orion camo. It was just, it was awesome. And yeah, that was actually my first nuke in this game. That is actually my third nuke this year i dropped two in h1 and i now i have one in modern warfare 2 and planning on dropping more i need some more nuclear content but after doing so much red gun and grinding for the polyatomic camo and then the orion camo i had an absolute blast going for it the red gunning in this game is absolutely nuts it is so comfortable it is extremely satisfying i really enjoyed it it's not too often that i have that much fun outside of sniping so that says a lot about this game and also i just found out that modern warfare 2 is the most popular game on steam that is nuts and that makes me extremely happy I feel like call of duty is on the rise once again and this has been what i've been waiting for what we have been waiting for for a long time so it makes me really excited for what else is to come later on this year i'm also really excited for season two i can't wait to see what they're gonna do with season two I was fairly happy with season one. I, I couldn't really think of anything necessarily bad about it other than it being extremely unnecessarily complicated.
That did not just happen. Screw this. This game is driving me nuts. Again, I feel like I've done everything under the sun to try to fix the crashing issues and nothing works. Now we're back into the game. And while I'm searching for another lobby, I just want to talk about the year of 2022 for a moment. Content wise, I just didn't really do that much. It was really difficult this year. And that really upsets me because I just possibly had the best year clips wise that I've think i've ever had in my whole entire sniping career for example my most one shot clips that i had ever hit in a single gear was back in 2018 with a pretty decent number of 23 one shot clips this year i hit 68 one shot clips so after h1 dropped which is the modern warfare remastered modded client one shot clips just started coming to me like crazy i hit like five in black ops 4 it like right at the start of the obey rc this year that's a game that i have a habit of going back to just for the sake of bare bones if it wasn't for the bare bones mosh pit i would not be playing that game because it without bare bones that game to me was just terrible but when h1 came out i started hitting one shot clips like crazy even though a majority of the one shot clips were on shipment and kill house i think between shipment and kill house i had somewhere around like 25 to 30 one shot clips i can't remember the exact number but a majority of them were on the smaller maps of kill house and shipment but i'm not going to talk about all the one shot clips that i've hit this year because i'm doing good at keeping them hidden until denied three now denied three is still going to happen i decided not to launch denied three this year because i just did not have enough variety on time i did not have enough clip variety on time but now that i'm coming up on that variety hold up okay i screwed that you see this is why i just i cannot do cut comms in okay well that was an accidental collat i cannot do cut comms and play at the same time it just it never goes well but now that i'm coming up on the variety that i really want i'm thinking about doing a best of 2022 montage to reveal some of my best clips that i've hit in the year of 2022 that have never been seen i haven't even posted them to twitter i'm doing really good with keeping clips hidden and you guys know that i've always sucked with that every montage that i've ever wanted to do where i've had to keep clips hidden i was such a failure at hiding clips i i i could never do it i wanted you guys to see these clips as soon as possible but for some reason and now that i'm getting older in the sniping realm and now that i set myself to a certain standard i really need to keep clips hidden but I really want to do it at the sake of re-establishing my YouTube presence because my YouTube presence has been really bad since the year 2020. 2020 wasn't bad, you know, per se, but toward the end of the year, it was not the greatest. And also I started to lose a lot of subscribers because I tried doing variety content on YouTube and it failed really bad like i started doing some watchdogs 2 content and trying to uh upload some of my live streams of different games that i was playing on stream other than call of duty and needless to say that you guys didn't really like that my subscriber count plummeted but also the amount of six on variants that i hit in uh h1 was really satisfying i'm extremely satisfied with how i performed in h1 i hope that uh the h1 modded client does come back to life at some point soon it died super fast but as soon as modern warfare 2 came out it was literally completely done there were no players in any of the servers whatsoever but however i did jump on h1 a couple of days ago and there were about 10 people playing in some of the bot servers but it was just really sad to say the least because i feel like modern warfare remastered was so underrated and it's honestly one of my favorite cods that game has a special place in my heart eh, because it 
actually got me through a lot during that time period. If you know, you know, but I'm not going to talk about it in this video. But I do want to possibly come out with a best of 2022 montage. So if you have any thoughts on that, let me know down in the comment section below. I would really, really appreciate it. But also when it comes to Denied 3, I can tell you that the theme is already set and the soundtrack is already set. But I really wanted Denied 3 to feature Modern Warfare 2. I really want to feature my best H1 clips along with some of the best Modern Warfare 2 clips in Denied 3, but I kind of want there to be a third title, but not exactly sure. I really want it to be Modern Warfare 2019 because I still love that game and I want to go back and play that game. I actually did a couple of times over the past week just to see uh, how the lobbies were and see if the game was still fairly active and Modern Warfare 2019 is actually still really really active for the year of 2022 content wise i really didn't do that much i haven't really uploaded on tiktok youtube has been very slow the only thing that i have been doing is streaming i've been stream streaming very frequently so my streaming schedule is literally all that I focused on because it didn't really take much effort like content does. So yeah, content this year was just really hard. I'm not going to allow myself to be upset about it. I'm not going to bash on myself about it. I'm just going to pick up where I left off and make sure that this time around, I don't let myself get burnout or incredibly overwhelmed because a lot of it really comes down to just that being burnt out from being incredibly overwhelmed but that's a little piece of advice i guess that we can all use is taking better care of yourself mentally doesn't matter if you're a content creator or if it's with work your passions in life or whatever it may be as mr han said in the karate kid too much of the good stuff is bad stuff you need rest even if these are things that make you extremely happy in life you need your rest because a lot of people get into the same boat be just because we love what we do we don't allow ourselves to take breaks from it because of a small little thing called FOMO, the fear of missing out. I think everybody has FOMO in different ways, shapes and forms. Like for us, like we have fear of not keeping up with content because we don't know what's going to happen if we take a small little break we're so afraid of what we're gonna miss out on and the same thing with business if we if we take a break in the work that we do we we could possibly be missing out on a <laughs> pretty good amount of money or missing out on certain opportunities where we can make more money so yeah it's not a bad thing it's something that we all deal with so yeah those are two things that i deal with heavily when it comes to i guess fomo the fear of missing out because a lot of you guys know that yeah i am self-employed i do have my own business and it's it, it it's hard to take breaks because you have a fear of missing out on possibly major financial opportunities. But also in content, it's the fear of missing out on opportunities for viewership. So I guess what I'm getting at is you should more or less have a fear of missing out on the opportunity for your own personal physical and mental rest because as people if we're missing out on that that is one of the most dangerous things when it comes to the human psyche so yeah don't be afraid of that personal time don't be afraid of taking time off if there was a missed opportunity it's probably for a good reason there could be a larger opportunity that comes around later you never know i know i'm pretty much just rambling at this point but hey this is important stuff so screw it just for the heck of it try it out this year when i allowed myself this year to take my time and be patient with myself and not rush things god dude i felt so much better i was not nearly as tired all the time both mentally and physically and once i got over that i guess fomo it really helped me so try it and i personally myself am going to continue on with that in the year of 2023 to take better care of myself focus on myself and my my mental awareness a lot more and my, also my physical awareness as well is he still on the roof there he is sit down bro Ooh, i've got some visitors here hello where did this other dude go to hello 
Hello. Oh, he took my kill. Nah, he had it first. It's okay. Oh, dude, he scared the crap out of me. Hello. Sit down, bro. Sit. Oh, oh, oh I sat down, bro. Haha. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh, no, I missed. Oh. Hello. 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 Ah! Ooh. Come on. Keep it coming. Ooh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Bro. He stays prone all game long. Hello, bro. Now you're AFK. What's going on, bro? Maybe he got a text from his mom. What you want for dinner, Johnny? See, now he's prone again. He got done texting his mom. Hello. Come back. No. Oh, they're back here. Oh, jeez. He scared the crap out of me. Jeez, why do you keep scaring me? Jeez, Johnny. Ooh, we win. I just now realized my game audio was muted through that whole entire game. Oh, God. Welcome to the life of a content creator. But on that note, I think it's time that I wrap this video up. Thank you guys so much for watching, especially if you watched till the end. I really, really appreciate it. I know this is a time where shorter content is pretty much the thing. So it's kind of hard to get people to watch like nine to 10 minute videos, if not longer. Our attention spans as consumers are just getting shorter and shorter. But speaking of that, I cannot wait to get back on TikTok and also YouTube shorts are coming back i'm super excited about it i've been working on a bunch of them for a while now i'm just happy to be making content again because content is my home i love streaming and everything but this is where i thrive the most but as far as everything that i talked about in this video when it comes to denied three possibly a best of 2022 montage let me know what you guys think of that because i cannot wait to start making sniping montages again it's been a while the last montage that i actually uploaded was at the end of the year in 2021 when i launched denied 2 i normally launch like two or three montages each year so i kind of want to go back to that you guys happy 2023 make this your year keep thriving i'm cheering you guys on i love you thank you for being here with me for all these years we have still many 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 more to go but let me know what you think down in the comment section below i always look forward to hearing from you guys but for now my name is keith aka dean tricks and i'm out peace